Hey guys, Al DeMarco here, uh, coming to you from the TV studio where we do our weekly show, which you can catch here online starting usually on Friday night. They put up the Sunday Countdown to Kickoff show where we preview, myself and Steve Budin, all your NFL games from a point spread perspective every single week. If your site hasn't had that show up to this point, well, I got news for you. You can start catching it as of this week, and that's the Countdown to Kickoff show. Behind me, you see this big green thing. Guys, if you've ever been in a TV studio before, that's the green screen they put up. That way they can go ahead and roll graphics behind you. It's what the weathermen stand in front of, you know, when they're doing their uh, weather forecasts. And you see the clouds and the screen of the maps and everything behind you. Anyway, that's why you got that big green thing behind me. Uh, today, Wednesday, we've got a couple of games. Connecticut and Pittsburgh and Big East football tonight. Got to talk about a couple of half handicappers. Uh, first of all, how about Anthony Red? Uh, started you off or actually ended the betting week with a monster play. A 75 dime winner number four in a row with Jacksonville outright as the home dog over Pitts, or excuse me, over Baltimore on Monday night. Then last night, another 50-dime winner in college football. Troy, plus the six and a half, covering in a three-point overtime loss at Florida International. Today, winning day number seven out of eight for Anthony Red. His 50-dime college winner, number eight out of ten. Your Connecticut Pittsburgh side, seven and two run with those 50-dime plays. Not only hitting last night with uh, Troy, but also cashing in last Friday when he gave you Syracuse as as a dog in a 49-23 blowout Big East win over West Virginia. So that's what Anthony Red's got going. And uh, by the way, A-Red, 477 dimes net profit the past seven days. That means a $10 better has won $4,775 in just one single week. As for me tonight... I've got a 15-dime play. Now, it may not sound as impressive as the big 50-dime play from Anthony Red, but understand, it's all a matter of perspective. I rate my plays any on a uh, rating scale of 5 to 15 dimes. 99% of them are between 5 and 15. So a 15-dime play is right there at the top of the scale. And I've won the last three. Remember, Southern Miss was the best bet in college football on Saturday, laying three at home, rolling 27-3 over SMU. Of course, last Thursday, gave you a 15-dime winner. Arizona in that 48-12 win is a 5.5 point home chalk over UCLA and two Mondays ago gave you the Jets uh, laying the points at home in the 24-6 win over Miami. 15 dime Big East game of the year goes tonight. UConn and Pittsburgh. Now listen guys, I'm not going to fool you here or try to fool you. I, you know, I always try to be a straight shooter with you. Myself and Anthony we have the same exact side today. I had to peek to see who he was on. He had put his side up first. Um, but we have the exact same side. So you can buy one of us. You don't have to buy both of us, okay? I'm just being upfront and honest with you. So anyway, that's what's going today. Now, as far as your money-saving discount coupon code, uh, today is going to be 15 Wednesday. 15 Wednesday. No space between the number 15 or the word Wednesday. That'll save you $15 off of any single purchase price uh, purchase you make today. 15 Wednesday is your money-saving discount coupon code. Enter that one prompted, and you'll save $15 off your purchase. Now, let's talk about your free play. Um, I have no opinion on the total in Pittsburgh and UConn. That one's sitting right around 41 and a half points. Let's talk about Game 6 of the World Series. Will it be played tonight? That's the big question uh, with the horrible weather forecasted uh, for the St. Louis area. Obviously, you know as well as I do that the Rangers are up 3-2 in the series. You may or may not be aware of the fact that I have a 10-dime play on the Rangers minus $1.50 in the series. So in essence, it's a 15-dime play when you factor in the juice should it lose. Um, my position here tonight is I have myself in a perfect Perfect position, okay? I've got my team up 3-2, a team that has not lost consecutive games since August, okay? And all they've got to do is take one of these two. I don't think they're going to win tonight, however. I do like them coming back in game number seven because, look, what's the Cardinals going to do? Send Chris Carpenter out on two days rest. They're going to send Kyle Loesch to get battered up at the hill, uh, battered on the hill once more. But tonight, they've got uh, Jaime Garcia pitching. And Garcia has pitched extremely well here in three home starts. The one road start, not so well, but 1.93 earned run average in three postseason home starts, seven scoreless innings of three hit ball and a no decision in game number two in which he struck out seven and walked one. Going against Colby Lewis, who has a 2.95 earned run average and three road starts. You know, his last six starts dating back to the regular season have all been on the road. 9-5 and five with a 3.43 earned run average, pitching on the road this season. In game number two, he allowed one run on four hits over six in the third innings. Uh, the Cardinals in the games that they have lost in this series have scored a total of three runs, and they batted 165. One for 12 with runners in scoring position in the 4-2 Monday loss. I think the way to go here, however, is St. Louis tonight. 
but I'm not bailing out on the series because I still think I'm going to win on the series. That's why I'm giving you as a free pick. So if you aren't involved with the Rangers on the series, I say you play St. Louis tonight. As far as I'm concerned, I'm not doing a damn thing in this game. And if I win tonight, great, I win the series. And if not, I'm still going to go, come up and uh, get the win in game number seven because I've got no problem riding Matt Harrison, who pitched much better on the road than he did at home this year for the Rangers. So that's how I'm playing. And again, your money-saving discount coupon code is going to be 15 Wednesday. Good luck, everybody, and I'll catch you again on Thursday morning.